What's up, carpoolers? Corduroy Pico's Mobile Vlogging Unit is back, and we are in unmotivated effect. Yes, kids, it's true. Corduroy Paco was not so motivated to shoot this today. And it's not you. It's not you. It's me. Straight up, where does like motivation or inspiration or perspiration really come from? A perspiration, okay, we know it's like, ugh, it's gross. But inspiration is a lot different than perspiration. First of all, it's not as easy to come by. Second of all, if you have oodles of inspiration, it won't be embarrassing at parties. And third of all, it's almost like an enigma. Where does it come from? How does it happen? And the fact that I'm doing this mobile vlogging unit about inspiration, how I was uninspired, just uh, kind of shows you, I don't know if that's a good thing or a bad thing. Is it show I'm creative, but I'm not. I'm just talking about how uncreative I am, but taking that and turning it in on itself and making it creative. There's a thing Wheezy Waiter once said, and I, I hold on to it, even though he doesn't really like me. <laughs> he did say one time, you cannot wait for inspiration. You can, if you want to be creative, you can't wait for your muse to whisper sweet nothings in your ear. You've just gotta say, okay, I've gotta be creative today. And, and so let's do this, let's hit it. That's what today was for me, man. First of all, I didn't put out a vlog last week. I put up uh, the third part of the locomotive adventures. And there's gonna be a next part coming out soon. So I knew I had to put one out. So I wanna be trying to hit these things every week. And that Wheezy Waiter quote, man, goes through my head every time. I, I'm like, I don't wanna do anything. I just wanna sit here and watch stupid things on Netflix that I don't even really want to see anyways. Because we have the Canadian Netflix in Canada, oddly enough, and it sucks. So to get back to it, it's like how do you get yourself motivated to do something or get yourself inspired to be creative? See, for me, one thing that scares me a lot is like something won't be good. And I just want it to be so good. And what if it's not? And it sucks, which then means I suck. I would love nothing more than to be one of these people that just does stuff. And if it fails horribly, like, eh, but I tried it. I tried my best, it just didn't work out. For me, it's like, if, if I try my best and it doesn't work out, it's like utter horrible failure. See, now even now this, it's like, was this even a good thing to talk about? So carpoolers, I hope you dug this vlog that was kind of about nothing, but so was Seinfeld, and that was a super big hit. So maybe it's the same. Check out all the stuff in the squawk box, subscribe, follow, do whatever it tells you to do. I don't even know anymore. There's too much stuff. And please, as always, remember, check your mirrors.